43 years ago, a group of men saw a creature standing in between a pair of trees, and that wasn't all. They found evidence they believe belonged to Bigfoot. It's been a lifelong goal of Peter Byrne to prove an urban legend that spans centuries. The lore of Bigfoot has taken him from the Himalayas to the forests of the Pacific Northwest. It was here in our region where he made what he thought might be a big discovery. Take a look at these hair samples Byrne collected after spotting an unidentified creature. Byrne was the director of the Bigfoot Information Center and Exhibition in Oregon at the time. He sent the hair and skin sample to the FBI for testing. In a letter to the FBI, Byrne said, I am writing again to ask if you could possibly arrange for a comparative analysis of some hairs that we have here which we are unable to identify. But he never heard back until this week. These newly released documents by the FBI show they did agree to test the sample, but the letter never reached him. The FBI said in 1977 it was concluded as a result of these examinations that the hairs are of deer family origin. The findings came in a response in the mail in the late 70s, but somehow the correspondence was lost. Now 93, Byrne told the Washington Post, we're just finding this out and it's disappointing. While it's not the answer he may have hoped for, he hasn't given up hope in proving the existence of Bigfoot. Today, Byrne lives on the Oregon coast and has a motion sensor camera outside of his home, hoping to one day catch a glimpse of the mysterious creature. In the studio, I'm Tim Pham, Krem 2 News.